It's Erica here with Tiny Acorn. So many of you may already know that I absolutely love Everlane. So today I'm going to be doing a haul and review of Everlane pieces that I have collected over the last few months. Some of these I have purchased at full price, some of them I've bought secondhand, and then some of them were gifted to me by Everlane. In this video, I will be giving you my honest review on all of these pieces and some tips on how to style them. Please make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it and subscribe if you haven't already. So Everlane is my absolute favorite ethical clothing brand out there. Whether it's using recycled bottles to make their shoes and garments or recycling the water that they use to make their denim. They continue to impress me time and time again. You can check out their about page on their website to learn more. So I would say if you're trying to take steps towards building a sustainable wardrobe, I highly recommend starting with Everlane. Their styles really do stand the test of time and so does their quality. So you can invest in an Everlane piece and know that it's gonna stay in your wardrobe for years and years to come. My top recommendations for Everlane products if you're just starting out would be to invest in their pants and their shoes. So you guys may have heard me say this, but I highly encourage you when it comes to building your wardrobe to invest in these key pieces that you're gonna reach for time and time again, like jeans, pants, and shoes. You need good shoes and you need good pants to build a wardrobe around and to build a good outfit around. I hardly ever find thrifted pants that fit me amazing, that I'm really thrilled about, and so I always buy my pants new. And Everlane is my favorite place to do that because not only do I have the peace of mind that comes with shopping at a sustainable and ethical clothing company, but I pay less compared to most other sustainable fashion brands out there. I'm going to be reviewing 15 different Everlane products in this video today, and most of them are different than the ones that I reviewed in my last Everlane haul and review video, which if you haven't watched that, definitely check it out. And I'm going to be linking everything that I talk about today in my description box below. Okay, let's get into it. So I wanted to start with pants. Everlane is fantastic for their pants selection. They have skinny, straight, wide leg, all of the different rises, and they have ankle length, regular, tall, so many different options. I love their pants so much that I actually have a couple pairs in several different colors because they're just so amazing. <laughs> so their wide leg cropped pant was actually the first Everlane product that I ever bought. The retail price on these pants is $68, which I think is one of the most amazing deals. It's very hard to find a good pant that is under $100 these days. And this one is definitely worth your investment. I loved it so much, I got it in three different colors. I purchased these in a double zero in ochre, bone, and black. They actually come in six colors and two different lengths, short and regular, and they come in sizes double zero to 16. I also really like how you can check how they fit on different body types on their website, which is a really, really cool feature. And it also comes in a lightweight version called the Wide Leg Crop Chino, which is the same price. And I've tried these on and I loved them. Um, I actually did an Instagram stories about this. So if you're not following me on Instagram, go check it out. So I just feel like the Wide Leg Pant is such a flattering fit. I love it paired with boots. Also paired with the Everlane Day Heel. It's super cute. That little pop of ankle showing. And I love the high rise. It comes in right at the belly button, so it's really great for tucking in sweaters, especially in the winter time. These pants are very similar to a classic vintage sailor pant, which has that nice wide leg and is also high-waisted as well. They're really on trend right now, but they are kind of hard to find. So getting a modern version like this Everlane pant is a great alternative if you like that style. Okay, so the next pair of pants I want to talk about is the Authentic Stretch High Rise Skinny Jean. These are also $68 like the Wide Leg Crop. I got these in a size 26 regular length and they fit great. I think having a classic 
pair of black skinny jeans are great to have in your wardrobe. They are very slimming, they elongate your legs, and I think they're also a very classic jean. So this comes in five different washes, it comes in three different lengths, there's ankle, regular, and even tall, which is awesome. You can also see how these jeans fit on women of different sizes, which is really cool. I love seeing different size models wearing the same pants, so you can get a better idea of like how it would fit on you. And the cool thing is that they just started offering this jean in a curvy fit. So this one is specifically designed for hourglass shapes. So Everlane adjusts the waist to hip ratio on the curvy fit to eliminate the waist gape. They're basically just gonna look amazing on you um, if you're a curvy gal or maybe you have a little bit more junk in the trunk and a smaller waist. So definitely check those jeans out too. Okay, the next pair is the Kick Crop jean. It's $78, it comes in sizes 23 through 33, and I got mine in a size 26. You actually are probably familiar with this pant because I have talked about these jeans so many times before. I actually did a giveaway in the past um, where I gave away a pair of the Kit Crop jeans. I love them so much, I bought them in two different colors. I have them in black and I have them in light blue. And they actually have them in five different washes online. Um, and I love that you can also see how this pair would fit on women of different sizes. So the rise is considered high at 10 and a half inches, which is the same rise that most classic Levi's jeans that are considered high rise come in at. What I like about these pants is that there is a slight flare at the ankle, which I really like because I find that oftentimes when jeans say that they're straight leg, they end up looking tapered on me. So the slight flare at the ankle um, creates just this long straight line. The cool thing is, is that because these jeans have a raw hem on them already, you can trim them to whatever length that you want them. These are 98% cotton and 2% elastane, which is nice because they do have a little bit of stretch in them to make them a little bit more cozy. I love this pant paired with the Everlane Day Heel. It's so cute and I love pairing it with all of my boots as well in the fall and the winter time. All right, so let's talk about some Everlane shoes. One of the most iconic pairs of shoes is the Everlane Day Heel. They come in at $145. So I got these in a seven, which is my normal size, and I got them in bright red. As you can see, I love a pop of red with an outfit. I think it's so cute. These shoes come in six colors, and they also have three different shades of all suede, and then two metallic options as well. And so they're 100% Italian leather, made in Italy. They've run true to size that I've found, and they do have this nice rounded toe with a little two inch heel. And then I love the elasticized back for extra comfort, and that way your heel's not riding up and down. So the reviews that I've looked at have shown that if you have wider feet, then they might not be the most comfortable for you. I would say my feet are probably average, um, and I find them to be very comfortable. I've worn them around a lot. If you're gonna opt for a heel, this is a great, great choice. Okay, so the next shoe I'm reviewing is the Everlane Day Gloves. I Actually, thrifted this pair in my last New Orleans thrifting video. If you haven't checked that out, definitely go watch it. It's an amazing find. I can't believe I thrifted these. Yeah, so the day gloves come in at $115. So I got them in a size 7 in the color brick. And then when I thrifted them, I thrifted the black ones in a size seven and a half. So I kind of got to see the difference in sizing. Uh, I think if I were to purchase them again, I would definitely get them in a size seven and a half because I really just like having a little bit extra toe room. And I noticed that with the sevens, um, you can see the bumps from my toes kind of like poking through just a little bit more on the top. Whereas the seven and a half, I don't see that as much. You can also check out their Re-Knit Day Glove, which is made out of recycled plastic bottles instead of leather. So that's awesome too. I'll make sure to link those below as well. I like how these shoes have little side vents and then also they have a cushioned insole, which 
make walking super comfy. I love how they slide right on my foot. I can pull them up with the little pull tab. I'm always reaching for this shoe when I need to just throw on a pair of shoes really quickly to go out and run errands or like walk to the beach. Or if I know I'm gonna be on my feet all day long, I will wear these shoes that way. I know that my feet will stay comfy. They also have that nice classic um, ballerina slipper look to them so they're gonna stay relevant in your wardrobe for a really long time so I highly recommend these shoes all right this next pair of shoes I am obsessed with oh my gosh okay so this is Everlane's new Western booty this boot comes in at $215 I got it in a size 7, which is my normal size, um, in the color Bone. It also comes in three different colors, including a suede, which is super cute. They do run a bit snug, so Everlane does suggest sizing up at least a half size. I see what they're saying now, um, and I probably would size up if I hadn't already worn these. Um, but now I can't return them. So the 7 works. I just wear it with a thin sock. It's made of 100% Italian leather. Um, it has a super cute tapered square toe. Um, love the angled heel on it. It makes it very western looking. And then it has this nice easy elastic back with a pull tab at the heel. I love the idea of wearing these boots with beautiful dresses, long dresses, colorful dresses, short dresses, um, also pairing these with pants, obviously. Um, the wide leg pant would be cute with it. Also the black skinny jean. I'm going to Nashville soon, so you better believe I'm gonna be taking these beautiful boots with me. They also have a version that's actually taller and more Western boot looking, which is really cool too. They make them in black and white for that particular pair. I will link both of these below. Okay, so last pair of Everlane shoes I wanna talk about is the Glove Boot Re-Knit. I got them in my regular size seven in the color tomato. They fit absolutely perfect. The main part of the boot is actually made from nine recycled plastic bottles, which is cool. It also has leather details on the back and there's no ankle gap. It forms to your foot. It's super comfy. And I love wearing these with the wide leg crop pants as well. They're just absolutely adorable. These shoes are so incredibly comfortable. I remember putting them on for the first time and I was like, I feel like I'm walking around in a shoe that is actually a sock, but they have a two inch heel. So they're super chic looking. They feel so comfortable and they just form to your foot. They're very roomy. And I think if you'll try them, you will also love them. Amazing shoes. All right, so this next item is the oversized alpaca crew knit sweater. I got this in a size extra small in the charcoal twist. I love the chunky collar here at the top. And one of my favorite things about this sweater is the fact that it has these balloon sleeves. It's so flattering, so cute on. This is just like the perfect cozy sweater to wear for fall and I've already worn it a ton. It comes in 12 different colors. It's 60% alpaca, 30% nylon, and 10% wool. So it's definitely going to be warm. When you hear wool, you think itchy, but I don't find it particularly itchy at all. I love that I can tuck it in and it's not too thick, so it's not like bunchy, but it also looks like a very thick warm sweater. Definitely recommend. All right, so Everlane is known for their cashmere sweaters. This one is the Cashmere Crew. I got mine in an extra small in the color black, and I got it because it's a staple sweater to have in my wardrobe that I can wear for years and years to come. This is never gonna go out of style. It comes in 17 different colors, so there's a color for everyone. This is made out of 100% certified grade A cashmere, which apparently is more durable and it pills less and it gets softer with wear, which is awesome. It's also lightweight, so you can tuck it into pants really easily. Definitely check this guy out. Okay, so this next item is their classic cotton box cut pocket tee. This comes in at $18. I got it in a size extra small in white. It comes in 15 different colors, which is awesome. 
Um, and it is 100% combed cotton, so it gets softer over time, which is great. These shirts are made in Los Angeles in the United States, which is even more awesome. What I love about this shirt is I love the little pocket detailing here. I love where it hits me. It hits perfectly at the hip. That way I can tuck it in if I want or leave it out if I want. Yeah, it's just a great staple to have on hand in your wardrobe. Okay, so this next item I had actually been wanting for a long time because I thrifted a white sweatshirt that I ended up wearing a lot. It's a little bit too big and it's not exactly what I was looking for. And I found this one on Everlane. It is the lightweight French Terry Crew. And I got this in an extra small in white. It comes in seven different colors. It's 100% cotton, machine washable and dryer safe, which is always a plus. And I like the length of it too. It's perfect for tucking into jeans. Um, I love the raglan sleeves. It also comes with like a wide collar. I feel like I would prefer it not so wide because I don't really like my t-shirts poking out through the top of the collar. That would probably be the only thing that I would change. I've already worn it a ton since I've gotten it and I love wearing it underneath chore coats and just like other fall layers. Okay, so this next item, you guys have probably seen me post about this on my Instagram. I've been wearing it a lot. It is the corduroy chore jacket. A coat like this you can use instead of wearing a jean jacket. It has a little bit more character than a jean jacket. I think um, the corduroy is really cute and it looks very vintage in my opinion. Um, also, I love the classic cut of the chore jacket, which has been around for a very long time. Um, and it's just now becoming popular again. It comes in three different colors, golden brown, which I got, navy blue, and bone. This jacket has almost a complete five-star review. I just love this coat so much. I love wearing it with skirts, layering it over the top of sweaters and sweatshirts. The sleeves are a little bit long on me, so I cuff them. You can style this up however you like and add your little spin on it. I like to put a little, you know, my little Bob Dylan pin here. Yeah, you can wear it buttoned up all the way if you like, which is a really cute look, or you can wear it unbuttoned. Yeah, I just don't know what else to say about this coat except that it's one of my very favorite pieces that I've gotten this fall and it is and probably will continue to be a staple for me in my wardrobe. All right, so the next piece I wanna talk about is the Renew Teddy Liner. Um, I got it in a size extra small in the color oatmeal. It comes in three different colors. It's made out of 100% recycled polyester, which isn't that awesome. It's like this nice cozy fleece fabric. It's very warm. I love that it has like these little pockets on the side, which are really convenient to slip your hands into. I like it as a layering piece. Um, you can pair this on top of like the black cashmere sweater um, from Everlane. You can wear this with the wide leg pants. You can kind of go for like a monochromatic look with this. Yeah, there's just a lot that you can do with this coat and I think it's a really great piece to have in your wardrobe for the fall. All right, so the Japanese Go Weave Essential Jumpsuit. I've actually been looking for a classic black jumpsuit for a long time, so I was thrilled to find this one. I got it in a size double zero in black, um, but they actually also have four colors. The Japanese Go Weave fabric is very light, it's drapey, it's wrinkle resistant, which is awesome for traveling. It's super, super cozy. I love that it has two pockets. It also comes with this nice tie here so that you can remove it if you want and wear it like that, or you can wear it around the waist to kind of accentuate your waist. I love layering this jumpsuit with like a white t-shirt underneath. Um, you could even put like a sweater over the top of it if you wanted to. It's honestly the best fitting jumpsuit that I have tried on. It's just a really classic style jumpsuit. It's great. I actually have traveled with this before. I wore it when I was down in LA filming my In Her Closet video with Arissa from Valley of the Dawn Jewelry. If you guys haven't seen that video, definitely check it out. I wore this all day long filming with her. I wore my Everlane day gloves with this as well and it was a very, very comfy from head to toe outfit. So, all right, so the last item I'm gonna be reviewing today is the Renew Transit Backpack. I got it in black, although it comes in four different colors. I love this backpack, you guys. 
I have been looking for a good backpack and this one just checked off all the boxes for me. It's not overly complicated. It has just the right amount of pockets. It's got a zip pocket here at the top and it also has a zip pocket here at the bottom. It has a water bottle pouch here on the side and it also has a water bottle pouch inside as well. It has this little pass through strap right here so that you can attach it to your luggage which is an awesome idea. They put a lot of thought into creating this backpack and it's everything that I ever wanted. It has a side zipper here. You can put your laptop in it and it fits up to a 15 inch laptop. It's also padded in the back for protection. It unzips at the top. It has an internal pocket slit here and then a second one there. I used this backpack to fit all of my camera equipment in it um, on my last trip when we went to New Orleans and it was perfect for that. I think it has just the right amount of compartments in it and I was really really surprised with how much actually fit in here. There was a ton of space still left for me to even fit like my traveling pillow which is like this big in there. Yeah so I love this backpack and my husband is currently trying to steal it from me but I am not letting him. <laughs> All right, so that is it for the review. I hope that this video was informative. I hope that you have a better idea of what Everlane is all about and the kind of quality pieces that they make. I've linked all of these items down below in the description box so that you don't have to hunt for them. So make sure to check it out there. And if you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments for me. I'll try to respond as soon as possible. If you have a really pressing question, just hit me up on Instagram and send me a direct message and I'll be happy to respond shortly. Okay, so one last thing. In light of the fact that I gathered all of these new items in the last couple of months, I feel like it is about time for a closet sale. So I'm gonna be having a closet sale this Sunday, October 20th on my Instagram at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So head over there to tiny underscore acorn if you're interested in purchasing some things from my closet. I'm gonna have all different kinds of stuff on there, you guys. I'm gonna have vintage, new, I have shoes, I have dresses, I have things that you've seen me thrift in videos in the past, all kinds of really good stuff, so don't miss it. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you like it, and don't forget to subscribe if you like styling and fashion videos, that's what I do around here, and I would love for you to join our little community. All right, you guys, have a wonderful rest of your day, and remember that you are beautiful just the way you are. Bye!